It is a common misconception that a person can break a human neck by grabbing the back of the head and the chin without supporting the upper torso. However, without supporting the torso, the body will simply turn the direction that the head is being turned in. By bracing the shoulders, it is quite possible to break the neck using mostly the same method. By bracing the upper body, the neck comes to a stopping point where it cannot be turned any further without force. Due to the structural design of the cervical vertebrae, muscles, arteries, and many other organs within the human neck along with the density of these organs, the human neck can only turn 4 twelfths the rotation of a full circle, unlike the owls. Due to the fact that owls have 14 vertebrae in their neck, allowing them to completely turn their heads 270 degrees, unlike humans that only have 7 vertebrae in their necks. According to wikianswers.com, the average maximum range of movement is approximately 162 degrees in women. Studies have shown that men tend to have a slightly lower range of movement. It takes between 1,000 to 1,250 cork to break the human neck. If struck, it takes 7 psi to break any of the bones in the neck between C1 to C7 of the vertebra, which these bones are called cervical vertebrae within medical terms. However, there are certain smaller parts of the cervical vertebrae that only take 5 psi to break.